Okay, today is self-care, and so I'm putting on new nails. I've let my, I took the other red ones off and um, let my nails breathe. And today what I'm doing is I'm using the Impress Color Red. They're all red. But what I do is when I have leftovers from these, I put them all in a baggie, okay? Because every once in a while, you know, I like a different color other than the color that comes in the box. And I had these. And I'll show you what I did with these. Um, the little these are not the sticky. These these you have to glue, but that's okay because I only wanted them on each one, each one on each finger, one on each hand. And but they weren't the same size as you can tell. One's a coffin size, one's a square. See that one's square. That one's kind of a coffin. But what I did is I have this little. This is a nail cutter. Okay. And so I took it, you see how that, I took it and I cut it off like that. You can see now. And then I just kind of took my file and we just kind of did that. And then it just kind of goes into the same style. So that's what I did. This one I don't need because that was for thumb. So, I'm almost, I'm finishing up, but I didn't want to do the whole ten fingers because it takes too much time. The favorite, my bet, my favorite way to put these on is to sit in my recliner, put a blanket out, and then I lay out, you know, for each finger, I size them up for each finger. And then you use your little, uh, they come with an alcohol pad to clean your hands, and I've already done that. So, now all I'm doing is applying my nails. And what you do to make them last a long time is you take the nail file that they give you and you file your nail opposite. Don't file it this way. File it this way. Okay? Opposite your nail bed. And when I say file, what I'm doing is just making this cause, this, this will be the friction between my nail and the other nail to make it stick. See that? See how it's... And then you just blow the excess. Leave that on there. Don't wipe that off. Just leave the excess. Then you take it and you peel it. And don't slide. Never slide these on because if you do, there goes all your sticky or your glue. Or Don't slide it if you're gluing it. Don't slide it if it's a sticky. And then what I do is I just roll it with my fingers and push. Like so. And then, see, as I got them laid out, it's just easier. You know which nail you're using. And again, do opposite nail bed. Make sure you got a lot of excess on there. Like I said, that serves as a adhesive. Let's put it that way. This stuff, if you leave it on there, it serves as an adhesive as well. And it makes, you know, the more friction, the more the sticky will stick to your stick to your nail. I hope I'm saying that to where y'all understand what I'm saying. All right, stick it, and then you just put it back here first and lay it down. Don't slide the nail. If you slide the nail, I assure you these nails will come off the same day you put them on. Within probably a couple hours. There you go. And then see, we only like the thumbs now. I always like, instead of one hand and the other hand, I like doing them the pinky, this one, this one. <laughs> then we have finished at the same time. <laughs> no, I'm weird. I'm a weirdo. And then blow. See? And you still have all that on there. I don't know if y'all are seeing this or not. And if it don't look like it's got very much on there, go back and do it again. That's what I do. Okay. See? Then I'm going to take it, peel the little sticky tab off, and then I'm going to place it right there. If you want to push back on that cuticle, do it like this. Don't lay it and push. Because, again, you're pushing that sticky off. And then roll it. I roll it just to make sure it sticks on both sides. I push and roll. I do that on all of them. And the last one. What 
couple of things I need to do today, so I thought we'd start with the nails. I'm also going to apply the Kiss False Lash No Glue Lashes today. That they say they stay on for 24 hours, and the last time I didn't leave them on, I just peeled them off. But this time I'm going to try to leave them on and let you know for how long they last. I haven't tried them in a long time. Okay, there you go. Do you see that? Okay blow what you're doing is you're blowing the excess off that's just you know the the top part where it's all um rolled up and then take your nail place it where you want it and lay it down push and roll my nails usually i say usually well all the time they stay on for about two weeks and i could leave them off for three weeks but about after the second week or in between the after putting them on to the second week now i will have maybe one get loose you know like it don't completely pop off but it might get loose and what i'll do is i'll just raise it up and put glue nail glue raise it back down and push it back down and i'll keep doing that if they keep you know one at a time just gets loose and that way i can get another i could probably get another well i know i could three weeks out of them but usually in three weeks they're not looking too hot so <laughs> but anyway there you go there's my nails for can y'all see there we go aren't they cute okay my hair is in a hat i my hair i was gonna wear a ball cap but i can't do it and do everything else so um self-care day also involves me doing my brows and here's what i do i use this it's called flute f-l-e-p-o-w I got it on Walmart website, and what I do is I just see those little hairs right there. I just trim them up. You can hear it, too. You hear that? I trim them up. I don't like all those little hairs. I will redo my makeup, but anyway. And up above, I trim them up above. And make sure they're even in there. I have to look in the mirror to make sure I got them all. Okay. See, don't that look much cleaner and better? I do that on my self-care days. Y'all have self-care days? I mean, days that you just have things that that need to be done on, your, on yourself? I do. Let me just, uh, self-care also um, is lashes, okay? So, I'm going to use this Tony Lash uh, Glue Eyeliner. I got this at the Dollar Tree. I do have uh, the Kiss as well, but let's see. Word my, word, 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 word my, I, I gotta have my, I do have to have my mirror for this because I have to be able to see. I like my lines straight. I don't like, you know, but y'all can still see, right? Okay, y'all can still see me. I start where the little lash begins and then I just run it right on down this is a lash glue if you are going to do wings again do not use the lash glue for your wing you're just wasting your glue use another eyeliner I haven't been doing wings for a while I love the wings but sometimes I just I just don't all right, I take this and I roll it. These are the flip up. These flip up. And I love these. So let's get this done. Okay. Then I take it and I put it right to where the little lashes start. Sometimes I don't get it just right, so I do it again. You can peel them off. Ain't no big deal. Ain't no thing. And then I take it and I push. I push it in. I hope y'all didn't just hear my stomach. Okay. There you go. See? Yeah. That's it. And then I do the same thing on this side. See how much easier that was than trying to put those darn things on? Forget that noise. I will say, if you go back and watch. Hang on. If you go back and watch... uh. 
just type I'll, I'll try to put it at the end when i when i first bought them and you know they may not be sticking because i've had these a while if you remember right i've had these a while so they might have just lost their glue their stick because they're not even wanting to stick on this so if you get these if they sit over a period of time perhaps they're just you know yeah so anyway there's that there's that little tidbit all right I like to roll mine because I like them to go, you know, round, not flat. And then I just take it again. And what's easy about these is once you start it, like when you go to put it on the, the front part of it, they stick. So it's not like you just have to, you know, I put it on there and then I just grab gradually guide it around. And that's how I do it. Now, I like to put mine on without mascara in the beginning. And the reason being is, it's just so, to me, it's just a lot more difficult to put these on when, you know, you got lashes out sticking out 100 miles an hour. You know what I'm saying? Then I let that set a minute. And while that's setting, I go back in. I didn't mean for this to be a get ready with me. It's supposed to be how to put your self-care it's self-care part of my self-care is the lashes so we're gonna go i'm gonna show you what i do i just use a i use a mascara i got this one from aoa and it's not it's not one that i would wear by itself with my lashes because it doesn't make them long enough not that there's any that i would wear by themselves because i just can't seem to find one that makes me happy and then what i do is put my finger up here slide my thumb and marry the lashes that way they stay on longer and they look better when you join your lashes up. See how easy that is? See how easy? And then, of course, I use this one. This is the mascara fiber lashes that I got from Timu. Boy, this stuff gets everywhere, but I do like it because it does make my bottom lashes long. And that's what I like. Because you guys know I like my lashes just as long as I like the top well not just as long but I want them to be defined and you be able to see them like when you're looking at me I want you to be able to see that but I want you to be able to see my bottom lashes as well I like my lashes to stand out period end of story I am wearing the Foera makeup today the um, Foera foundation and as far as the cheeks, I'll show you what I put on. Okay, see, that's, that's, yeah, that looks good. Yeah. Okay, again, that's the 3D, 3D? 7D, Romantic Bird Mascara Lashes, Fiber Lashes from Timu. All right, this is what I'm wearing. This is Make Me Up Eyeshadow Palette. Don't know who it's by. Don't, don't even care. But it, it's great. It's great. I got this at the Dollar Tree. Isn't that cute? I got this at the Dollar Tree. I got mascara all over me. And I put that right there on my cheeks. But I also put that right there on my eyes. And then I used uh, this color right here. From here up to the white. And then I took a little bit of this and blended it in on the sides. Y'all, y'all. And let's see. I guess that's it. Anywho, there is that part. Okay, that's, I got my nails on. I got my lashes on. And my lashes now, I will leave one all day. I don't go to bed with them, no, because these are not the... Even these, they said only 24 hours. Well, what's 24 hours going to do for you? Unless unless you're partying. Sorry, I shouldn't have done that. But I hate it when that makeup gets on my, my white nail. Anyway, unless you're up all night or you're at a party or something and you're going to be up all night, then they may last. But tookie snooky. I had such an easier time the first time I used those. And again... The, the sticky stuff on it may just be old because I've had these for, what, four months? I don't know. I can't remember when I did them. 
I had a lot easier time doing them then than I did now. And they see they just they're falling down. They're not even sticking. So skip that noise. Okay, just I like these anyway. These are more bold. These are more a bold, and I like them better. Yeah. Yeah. I'll have these. These are, somebody said, um, when I wore them last time, Lauren Conti. She said it looked, sorry, my thing's farting. <laughs> I love this. It smells so good. It's that LA Colors Mood. I got it at the Dollar Gentle. It's like a mood. Um, you put it on, it's clear, and then it sets a minute, and then it turns pink. Not dark pink, just a, just a tint pink. Anyway, Lauren Conti was commented on my lashes, and she said it looked like I was wearing the uh, extension lashes, and that made me feel good, because I like it that they look like extensions, but I wasn't. I was wearing these. I got these from Timu. See how they, let me turn them. See how they flip up? That's, I like that. See how they're flipping up? Well, you can see on my eyeballs. I like these. I like these a lot. So, that's what I was wearing, Miss Lauren. And there says 207 on there. I don't know if they would come up if you typed in the 207. If you want the link to them, let me know. I will. If I can remember, I'll try to put the link down below as well. Anyway, you know, anyway. I'll put it down below anyway. Let's see. Make sure I got them straight. Sometimes I'll put one over here and one over her, and it don't look right, but I think I got them right. Yeah? No? Maybe? Okay, so that, um, that is my self-care as far as putting nails on. I showed you how I did those. And I was going to show you how to do these, but they just not sticking. The, and like I said, the first time I used them, they just stuck right on. But these, and I can tell they're not wanting to stick even now in this little thingamajiggy. So they're not thingamajiggy. Do y'all know what a thingamajiggy is? See, they're not sticking. They're not. I think the bonding. When you get these, let me just suggest, if you're going to use them, then use them up quickly, soon. Because, I mean, they're sticking on here now, right now, but the sticky goes away when, and I paid 16 bucks for this stupid thing. Which, as you can tell, other than the two I threw away, I used, I've used them, but I might keep those just, I don't know. I could use glue with them, but then what's the purpose, you know? What is the purpose? I don't know. I ask you, but I don't know. I'm going to show you what I did with my lashes. They were in my drawer, and my my drawer was just filling up, and I couldn't <laughs> I couldn't uh, keep them together. Anyway, so I took them out, and I had a bunch of these. Um, one of my brother's friends had bought these off some kind of website. He was going to resell them, but he didn't, and he gave them to Daniel or Philip, my brother. So my brother asked me if I wanted some, and I said, yeah, because I got my perfume bottles over here sitting in them. And um, I thought, you know, that's a good idea for my, my lashes. See? And that way I can also, when I'm deciding what lash I want to wear, I can just, those are not empty, see? I can just go through them and look to see which lashes I want to wear. So, Simple Simon. I liked it like a lot better, a lot better. So that is not a self care. <laughs> well, actually it is because it's to my advantage. I set it to where, let me show you. Okay, there we go. My self care, it's right here beside me. Here's my table. Um, beside me where I can reach over, go through my lashes, see which ones I want. Um, these are my, um, the palettes I use, my eyeshadow palettes are in one and that way I can reach over so when I'm you know doing my makeup and then these are all my eye sticks and face uh, face spray you name it anyway everything to my advantage you know what I'm showing to my fingertips you there's little self cares that I do that I, I don't ever show you guys what I do like um, most of the time when I'm doing get ready with me, I don't even show you putting on my lashes. Um, I do my own brows. I'm trimming my brows. 
and putting on my nails. I don't even show you guys that. But there's another thing that I do that I'll show y'all because this is a little TMI. So if you want to, I'm going to show you how to get the hairs on my nose. And if you don't want to see that, then just skip right on over just a couple of seconds. Okay. But I use this, the same one. But what I do is I wipe it down. I have, I have alcohol pads right here. And I also have alcohol that I've already sprayed on it and wiped it down from here to here and from here to here. I wipe it down regardless. And then what I do is I turn it on. And I just get those hairs out of my nose. Can you hear it? And then what I do is I open it up, clean it out, and then do the alcohol swipes. I mean, nobody uses it but me. So, you know what? Seeing that gets the hairs out of your nose. I have a... See, this comes off. And then what I do is I clean it out. Real good. And then I put it back together, rub some alcohol on it, and it's ready to go for the next time. And I don't have to worry about cleaning it because it's already clean. Anyway, um, I forgot what I was saying. I forgot what I was saying. See, now it's ready. It's, it's all ready again. And usually I do my brows first, and then I do my nose, and then I clean it. That's the process. Now, I do have another one that I do use. Um, I've showed it to you guys before. It's this one. I got this one off of Walmart as well. This is a Phillips. And this one also can clean your nose. But I mainly use this one for up here to even it out. And then I have a little comb that I put on it. Um, I have a hard time finding my comb. Anyway, I have a little comb that slips down on this, and I'll run it on my, my brows to get them thin because I don't like thick brows. So, these two little thingy-majiggies are what I use for self-care. Sorry, I was trying to find that other one. It's in my drawer somewhere. Um, this one and this one. And I get them off the Walmart website. They're easy to find. I've had these for years, so you, I don't know if they have the exact same ones, but hey, you can find them, you know, this one turns like a, and then you open it up here and you clean it out. And then this one don't. This one runs on batteries. They both run on batteries. So this is two of my self-care um, utensils for my face. Okay, because I like my face to look good. So there's that. Brows and nose and everyone knows, you know. You know, so there's that. Put a little gloss on. All right, that is it for my self care today. Now I need to finish getting my face done, and um, well, I got my face done. I need to um, put some jewelry jewelry on. I got my hat out. Isn't this cute? Isn't that the cutest hat? I don't have a red one. I think I ordered a brown or a tan one. I can't remember. I got this one, the black one, remember? And it is so warm. And I'm wearing my Impact Jesus International shirt. And let me show you what I'm wearing it with. I'm wearing it with my PJs. I call them PJs. They're really, I wear them around the house. Um, they're so warm. That's what I wear around the house, so don't judge, okay? <laughs> don't judge, don't judge. And I do have something coming in the mail. I think it's my Etsy. I have an Etsy haul for you. And I say a haul. It's not necessarily a haul, per se. It's just one thing that I've ordered from Etsy, and it's the cutest ever. And um, it's coming in today because I was tracking it. And I don't know if it's here yet or not. <laughs> But I did want to do the self-care first and show you guys what I do that I, that's not on camera. There's a lot of things I do for myself that you guys don't see. So, you know, the self-care on trimming. When I pick self-care days, it's usually once a week because, you know, I like the hairs gone and I like the brows looking halfway decent and the nails or whatever. Um... Usually once a week, sometimes tw uh, once every two weeks. Just depends. Depends on what the nails are looking like. Um, it was time for new nails. And um, it was time to trim 
and all that good stuff. And again, I wanted to do the self-care because I wanted to put those other self or non-glue lashes on to see if they'd stay on for two days. Because the last time, like I said, they went on good, and but they didn't stay. Or they didn't stay. I peeled them off. They were stuck good. That's my point. They were stuck good. So if you buy this stuff, I don't know if they have an expiration date on it. I already threw the big thing away, the, you know, the picture package. If they do, look and see if they have an expiration date because they're not going to stick in 16 bucks for that. You know, I should have went ahead and just used them anyway. And, you know, I had that little attitude of ain't nobody got time for that. So when I can slap these on so much easier. And again, let me just tell you, if you are an eyelash wearer and you're new to my channel, and by the way, to all the newbies that have signed up on my channel, sorry, that's right, I'm looking at I'm talking to you. To all my new subbies, um, I want to say thank you for subbing. Hello, thanks for coming over to my channel. Um, we over here on my channel, we comment a lot, we talk to each other, we give our opinions, it's all good. Now, if you're going to be mean, like, you know, mean and hateful, I will delete you. I will delete your comment. We don't be mean on this channel. And what I mean by being mean, I mean like you're so ugly or you're fat or you know what I'm saying? Stuff like that. We don't do that over here. We don't do that over here. So we're kind over here. We're kind, Jesus loving people. That's what we are. <laughs> anyway, welcome to our channel. Welcome to, I will, welcome to our channel because all my, it's not just my channel. This channel belongs to all my subbies. Everybody who has subscribed to me, this is their channel too. So welcome to our channel. We are so very happy to have you. Anyway, as I was saying, um, the Tony, I got these, I got, I have like four of them in my drawers back up. This is the Tony Lash Glue Liner. And when I say lash glue liner, you do what I what I just did. You put it on, but it also serves as a liner as well. I don't put it down here. I use a normal or, or you know a normal liner, but it serves as a liner. It serves as a uh, glue, and it's it's just a game changer when it comes to that because you don't have to use glue if you use too much. You know the glue squirts out and it gets in your eye. Not good for your eyes either. And all that fun stuff. So when you use these, it just goes on like a liner. Wait just a second and just stick that sucker on and you're done. You're done. It is a game changer. Okay. Like Jesus. He's a game changer. So anyway, um, I use the Tony around the house or if I'm just running out to the store, if I'm doing a major dress up. And I'm going to be out a while or whatever. I use the Kiss. Because why? Because the Kiss is a good one. It lasts a long time. Okay. This one did. And sometimes it comes loose. But I do carry one of these in my purse. So if it does come loose, I just... Ch -ch -ch -ch, and it's back on. So anyway, Kiss Lash Glue and the Tony. You get this one at the Dollar Tree for $1.25. This one... Four something or five something. I can't really remember. But these are good. If you wear fake lashes, false lashes, these are game changers. You need those in your life. Okay? Okay, guys. I'm making grilled cheese today for lunch. And we're going to have chicken again tonight. Because Danielle always brings chicken strips home. So, we'll have that tonight. We had chicken last night the night before. So, today, I'm just going to have some... Grilled cheese and some broccoli soup is what I'm having. I, it's better than a cheeseburger or whatever, so don't judge. And I'm tearing my bread up trying to get the stupid stuff off of it. So anywho, that's what I am having for my lunch. And I normally don't have lunch. I normally just wait till day and get home and eat then. But what time is it? I don't have my, my watches. My watch is charging. It's 25 to 1, so, yeah. 0.25 to 1. Man, I'm going to have to make another bread. That one's four pieces. Just leave it to me. I don't want to waste that bread, but I ain't having it. I ain't having it. There we go. 
hate that cheese I got. Cheap cheese. I'm going to have to start watching to see what kind of cheese I get because I don't like it. It hardly melts. That's the thing. This cheese just, it's like it don't want to melt. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that cray cray? Alright, so anyway, that's what we're having. I'll show you. I'll show you the end result in a minute. I don't have tomato soup, but I do have broccoli cheese soup. Broccoli cheese with a grilled cheese. I think so. Okay. Broccoli cheese soup. Num nums. A num a num a num nums. Num a num a nums. All right. My toast, my, 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 my grilled cheese is red-eyed. All I got to do now is put some, y'all like stuff on yours like mayonnaise because I love mayonnaise on mine. But a lot of people just do grilled cheese and nothing on it. Well, I'm not going to say it's gross because if that's what you like, then that's what you like. But it's not what I like. <laughs> okay, let's try this goodness. Okay, okay. Here's the grilled cheese. Well, look at that man. I squirting out. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. Finger licking good. And I like mine crunchy. My toast. Daniel calls that burnt. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Mm Cheese and broccoli soup. Mm-hmm. Mm I love cheese and broccoli soup. I could eat that with just crackers. The cheese and broccoli. Mmm. 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 That's good, guys. I'll put you down when you see me. This is not going to be a neat with me, so we're not going to linger, okay? Mmm. Hear that crunch? Mmm. 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 This is good. I don't know how healthy this is. Probably not at all because I'm having bread. I'm having cheese. This soup can't be that bad. But at least it's not pizza or cheeseburger. Okay? And french fries. So <laughs> there you have it. That's my weekend food. <laughs> mm -hmm. On weekends, I splurge. Weekends, I either have pizza, cheeseburger, french fries. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Chibu. Mmm. Mmm. My little purse. That's from Timmy, too. No, I mean... Shein, these are from Shein. This is from Timu. Y'all, if you buy from both places, it's hard to remember exactly who has what because some, they have the same stuff. Some of them do. Timu and Shein, they have some stuff the same. Clothes. Well, I'm not going to say that because I don't think I've seen the same clothes on there. Look at this. Mmm. 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 Did I pray? Oh, I don't even remember. Lord, bless this food. Bless it to my body. And Lord, make it skinny food. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. It is well with my weight. <laughs> I 
All right, guys, I'm going to get off of here. Oh, I'm drinking in sweet tea. There's no ice because I have a big pitcher of tea in the refrigerator, and it's already cold, so. As long as it's cold, it's all good. It's all good in the hood. One more bite with you guys, then you guys can go eat your lunch, okay? Okay, here we go. See, it's not burning on that side. Actually, it's perfect for me. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Okay. That's it. Thanks for watching. See you later, alligator. coffee time around here it's coffee time around here i wish i knew if the mail lady ran because i don't need this light on anymore let's get them off let's get them off shall we <laughs> waste electricity i'm always on the electricity kick trust me if there's there's a light on i turn it off <clears throat> once in a while i'll walk into the kitchen and forget and daniel will say uh, did you forget to turn the light off? It's like, <laughs> I need something for my whips, okay? Hold that thought. Okay, let's get something for these lips of mine. I had lipstick on a while ago when I was doing that video. But, of course, y'all saw me eat. So, this is Summer Fridays. I love it. If I ever get low and run out, I am ordering more. It's like, <clears throat> raise you up. It's like 18 bucks but you know what it's worth it it's like it's good stuff real good stuff has a little bit of tint okay when I'm in town sometimes instead of uh, it's got see the tip instead of applying you know lipstick if it goes all and, and all that I'll just put on my Summer Fridays. This one is in, I don't, does it have a, um, Poppy. This one's in Poppy. And then they have one that is in, uh, I think the newest one. It's like a, it's a, I want to say vanilla, but it, it's kind of a, it's a beige looking, real light, neutral, natural color. You know what I mean? But it would be pretty with the lip, with the lip liner. But anyway, I love this stuff. Love, love, love.